Hey guys, Travis2888 here. I thought I'd do something a bit different with my Minecraft video this time round. Um, I'm basically sitting and watching through the 10 times footage as it goes and then just commenting on what's happening because most of my videos have no commentary for the Minecraft. I just kind of play, speed it up, see what happens. Um, so yeah, you've seen, if you've watched the series so far, you've seen there's a bunch of stuff I'm doing. I've built a house. I'm um, expanding downwards. I'm going to build myself a slightly larger area underneath the house. I'm going to continue with that. Um, and there's also a bunch of other stuff I'm doing as well uh, outside in the town. The objective is to basically end up with a town that is fortified and, um, you know, it's just a full village basically with a whole bunch of stuff going on. Walls, iron golems, um, blacksmiths, all that madness. So that's the plan anyway. Um, I think the villagers have started to populate a little bit more because they put doors in that they can actually use as opposed to, you know, just door frames. Um, I understand a lot of the videos and stuff, although it's sped up, a lot of it is just basically minecrafting, so it's just, you know, digging or standing waiting for furnaces to do whatever it is they do so my editing for my minecraft stuff will be changing slightly this is gonna basically be the last episode of series two um in this format and then series three i will be doing it slightly differently so i will be recording the footage speeding through it um skipping through it doing some editing and stuff making it a little bit more professional rather than just kind of letting music play and etc. So I've been out of the world of Minecraft for a little while now and it's kind of fun being back and playing it again to be honest. Um, I think at the moment here I'm trying to build a... I'm doing a basement, like quite a big basement at this point, but um, I thought I'd do it like a... you know how you would normally look for ores basically. Reveal as much surface area as possible and get it uh, dug up. Good words, fantastic. Um, I did confuse myself. I've never really done a big kind of storage warehouse before, so I don't really know the kind of sizes of put a chest here, do that, do that, da, 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 da. you know what I mean? Does that make sense? When you're digging, you can just kind of go, okay, too wide by too wide and blah, blah, blah. But then to get chests and things in the right place and kind of make it look good as well, I don't know exactly how far apart it needs to be and all that stuff. Anyway, uh, so in the meantime, um, let's talk about Minecraft, because that's what we're watching, or what you're watching, although I am watching as well. Uh, it's a bit surreal, like being in two places at once. Um, so yeah, I've found my voice now. Hooray! Um, it never went anywhere in the first place, to be honest. So yeah, Microsoft has been uh, making some interesting decisions, purchasing Minecraft outright for some stupid amount of money with too many zeros for me to even count. Um, so what do people think about that? I mean... I'm not even sure that Microsoft are actually going to do anything with it. I think they're pretty much just going to leave Jeb to run it, aren't they? I mean, I haven't actually read anything about it, but um, as far as I know, Jeb's been kind of in charge of it while uh, the other guys at Mojang have been dealing with scrolls and some other stuff, some new games and things. So, I mean, I'm kind of hoping it's going to be like a Disney takes over Marvel type deal where they kind of come in, infuse a load of money to it, support it, um, and then from there, basically just let the people who know what they're doing get on with it, which would be awesome. Um, the only thing that I'm thinking about is the fact that it's now not an exclusive to Microsoft. Uh, it's not an exclusive to the Xbox and PC and stuff, which is interesting that they've waited until now or that it became an option once it had been released on the PS3, PS4 and com uh, coming up the PS Vita as well. I don't really know what they're doing. Um, the only thing I can think of that makes any sense is that they've seen that Sony's sales for their consoles are pretty impressive and they've kind of thought, well, you know, Minecraft is popular the PlayStation at the moment is popular so if we buy Minecraft then when people buy Minecraft on the PlayStation we get monies which you know in itself that's not a bad it works well, well it may work uh, if that's the plan of course it might not be the plan it might just be that they've gone hmm, Minecraft that's good so yeah I think I don't even know what I'm doing currently I think I'm just kind of digging a mine where am I I'm in my basement leading to my other basement which has no more basements. It's like the Russian nesting dolls of basements, but um, not fully yet. See, I've never built anything massive with the underground, so I think what I'm trying to do is basically build one of those things that I've seen so many times where people have pillars filled with chests and all this madness, uh, where you know each thing is a, is a series of chests for one specific item. Um, there are a hell of a lot of items in Minecraft, so 
this is going to end up being some kind of cavern. I don't know what I'm going to turn this into. Maybe some kind of lobby for my basement once the um, the main event is up and running. Um, built a fence. That makes sense. Oh no, I remember what I was doing now. Just as a, to put this into perspective, I um, I haven't played for quite some time. Um, and obviously this is me basically trying to get back into Minecraft. Um, but this footage here I recorded in my last session about two months ago. So I'm kind of watching this to catch myself up with whatever the hell it was I was doing. Uh, at the same time, and wow, using a torch, really? Okay, whatever you say. Uh, using a, uh, uh, trying to catch up with what I was doing. Sorry, I lost my train of thought entirely when I realized that I'm, what am I doing? Okay, this seems normal. Just mining with whatever I have to hand. That's yeah, go and make some pickaxes, you idiot. What are you doing? Um, yeah, so like I was saying, I am um, basically watching the footage to kind of get a, a kind of footing as to where I am. Uh, it would be kind of handy if I went outside in this video because I don't know uh, exactly where my um, town is at at this point. I know I've built the foundations for the wall. Um, I hope you like the wall design. I'm quite pleased with it. I'll be honest, it's one of the few things so far that I'm pleased with. The mine entrance as well is another thing in one of the previous videos that I've done that I might change around a little bit because it's it's not that great. It's very bulky and stuff. I kind of wanted to have a village mine or whatever, but yeah. Okay, so um, I am guess I'm chopping down some trees. So yeah, big project. Uh, I'm going to expand the church, build a cathedral in the town, I'm going to build some more houses for the villagers, expand the blacksmith, make it look like a blacksmith, do some van random stuff, um, get some farms going and stuff like that as well within the village, let the villagers kind of do their thing, do some walls, obviously like I say, put some iron golems around it, all that sort of stuff. Um, once that's all happened, then uh, I will begin my adventure as it is, where I go out and hunt monsters and all that sort of stuff. I'm still playing it on Peaceful, but that's just because um, it's just a more casual way of playing it. I know people are oh, filthy casual, yeah. but you know, there's no point in me doing a video where I just keep getting blown up by creepers. Um, and at the same time, I kind of enjoy it more when it's just me floating about, punching cows, kicking down trees, uh, and just digging holes. <laughs> uh, although I will go on a kind of monster raid at some point, for sure. Okay, um, don't really know where I'm, what am I doing here? Yeah, I'm literally just getting a bunch of wood. What was I going to use this for? I don't know, I think I decided that the fences were a good idea to go down the sides of the, um, you know those things, the, uh, the chest holder wants it. They're going to be in my big basement. Yes. Oh, it's all coming back to me now. It's all coming back to me now. Tiny little oak farm. That'd be fine. I'm sticking it to my pumpkin patch. I do need to turn the monsters on at some point, actually. There's a whole bunch of wolves dying about. So I kind of want to get some of those. And I need to get some bones to be able to um, convince them to be my friend. So I may turn the monsters on and then go on a bit of a, a, bit of a hunt for some skeletons. See how that goes. I have got fairly decent armor all over now, to be fair. Um, had quite a lucky find early on with some diamonds and stuff. I mean, I think the axe is basically the last remaining piece um, of what I found. But let's have a look and see as to where this goes. Some of these oak trees are growing very quickly. Oh, dude, it's sped up, isn't it? Yes, good work. As you can see, I'm a professional. I pay close attention to my own videos, uh, so you should too. They are obviously of high quality, uh, they are intelligent, sporadic, in fact sporadic is probably where I'm going to leave it with that to be honest, that's probably the most apt description of my videos. So um, yeah, at this point I'm literally just going to duck out. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video, I just thought I'd do a bit of chatting just to kind of get back into it a little bit.